All right, Master Mason Note, we just got off of here. We're on break, tearing it up in here today. Uh, really not too much going on. I could, again, write this out for you, but hopefully you can appreciate what I did last night for you. Any of these are compre comprehensible constructs to me. They're essentially mathematics. And just off the floor, I had a double, triple quintilla I'd set up on the floor. Had a lot of these twos we were running. A two by two foot, 26 inches, two inches thick, probably nine foot long, about 300 pounds. We were wrestling around all day, making noise. Uh, and I caught this where I had to make the adjustment. I started burning back instead of our normal procedures, getting ahead of it, had to clear out the line, reset, load as I'm going. Standard procedure, except for a little different. I added a plus one. And essentially, you could write that out. That is the Schroeschringer's equation, Your Honor. And don't let his speculative ass tell you no different, him or Sh uh, Heisenberg. Because it turns into... And, uh... <laughs> so then you go to the case, you go to the timeline, the wiggly squigglies between this thickness and this length on that system to the cost in a timeline about what MG correct physics V at the top looked like in that spot. You know, it's, it sounds like that, but honestly, hopefully, I hope you guys understand, at least for the mill guys. You know, this is, I've been around enough of them. This isn't nothing personal, and hopefully we're, we're working something on the outside. Uh, you know, obviously, there's time for those things, and when they present themselves, you could go to the Sears guy that is the M. Shaw guy, that is the psychologist, that is, all right. So anyways, you know, and, and that's where that goes. And how do you get the timeline to get there? Your Honor, in that case, that X, Y, Z case, it's gonna take some time. Like, we gotta adjust that on the floor somewhere else. We handle that right now. Those are the guys that know that turns into the shit on the floor, right? You know, people got, get banging around. And you have to look at the overall nature of the universe. That is a militia on the ground. That is a barracks that is in some way has an infraction here acceptable in the timeline of the universe but there will come a time when that when that thing is right there and you got to deal with it given what offset you do and therefore i see that that's going to calculate negative 10 minutes somewheres i just haven't figured it out yet so that that 10 minutes is that schroeschringers or heisenberg's in schroeschringers that's a plank constant. That's a one move of 10 minutes that I'm going to integrate into the red shifting of Hubble's constant. All right. Uh, so, you know, again, and, and it's really hard to figure out which ones you want to do. And the main line on that is, well, I could, I could do that, but right now I'm getting paid to be a stonemason. Got to process this rock. At the end of it, we can use the cameras. You can use your recall, your supercomputer and uh, be able to do that. Now, obviously that's gonna be red shifted with some influence a little bit, and that's because of gravity. This is what it is going to be as it's running. As it sits right now, there's a whole bunch of M1, M2s about how it should go with a capital one. And while we get there, we will see the divergent paths, and if I, if any of these diverge, a flip, a crack, a how to break it and throw it away, that even though five minutes, five minutes, five minutes, two on these probably one, it turns into, well, that was a five minute operation and correct in that set because somebody over there would watch it. And burn, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, right, up, down, 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 ding. That was right. And it's it goes right to the uh, H. This one, Two, zero, two, graviton, Higgs, into that. And that'll also work universe to any other set that you might have. All right, now again, I'm trying to stay away from some of that harder stuff that those aren't my barracks or anything like that. But the notation is that commonly happens. What we are looking for, especially as a sharps or a salty on the board, is when those events happen. That was a negative one on my board about my, even if we're equal in systems in here, essentially an apprentice. That'd be a grandmaster over there. 
Are you personally, are you awake this morning? So anyways in here, often, you know, it's sometimes that that happens. I mean, you could run every hypothetical M1, M2 that happened to that girl at Fort Hood, right? And it makes you think. So, I mean, then you go to Fort Jackson and there's a guy, check the face, the expressions on your face, check it out. And you got guys drilling and then you go out there and it's like somewhere is between A to B here. Something happened. What are the numbers? What, what is the, I mean, what is the number here? Because that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for somebody to put that negative one into three, X, Y, and Z. X is the number, Y is the function, Z is which one of those function at the quantum breakdown. When two Y happened, X, Y, the graph, same box right there, that one's got a crack in it, different Y. Except for then it's going to be that. Except for then it's going to be a manager dealing with a, a floor manager or something like that. Hey, salty, right? Energy is better conducted if I would have snatched him up as a salty or as a sharps officer. You're mine now for a certain amount of time giving gravity about that rock. Right? And you go, you, if you go arguing about, about it with me, kicking and screaming too much like a bunny, you're going to be fooled. We do this for gravity. It doesn't often, or at least isn't well understood. Trying, we're getting there. This is not a write out, X, Y, Z. You have to understand this is gonna be done before the math is ever relative. Kid comes in, you want them to get that mass gap as the boss. You want them to be able to write that down. You want them to be able to learn. Obviously, Salty's holding the card. I could give it to you. We should come out with that same answer, regardless of that person, that fight, this scenario, that situation, Heisenberg, Schrostringer, Lorenzo, any of them in that jury box, right? Catch you on the next one.